Second Samuel 22, 31. As for God, his way is perfect. The word of the Lord is tried. He is a buckler to all them that trust in him. Second Samuel 22, 31. Second Timothy 4, 18. And the Lord shall deliver me from every evil work, and will preserve me unto his heavenly kingdom, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. Second Timothy 4, 18. Isaiah 26, 20 to 21. Come, my people, enter thou into thy chambers, and shut thy doors about thee. Hide thyself as it were for a little moment, until the indignation be overpassed. For behold, the Lord cometh out of his place to punish the inhabitants of the earth for their iniquity. The earth also shall disclose her blood, and shall no more cover her slain. Isaiah 26, 20 to 21. Proverbs 3, 25 to 26. Be not afraid of sudden fear, neither of the desolation of the wicked when it cometh. For the Lord shall be thy confidence, and shall keep thy foot from being taken. Proverbs 3, 25 to 26. Proverbs fourteen twenty six, In the fear of the Lord is strong confidence, and his children shall have a place of refuge. Proverbs fourteen twenty six. Proverbs 31, 8 to 9. Open thy mouth for the dumb in the cause of all such as are appointed to destruction. Open thy mouth, judge righteously, and plead the cause of the poor and needy. Proverbs 31, 8 to 9. Psalm 32, 7 Thou art my hiding place Thou shalt preserve me from trouble Thou shalt compass me about With songs of deliverance See, love, Psalm 32, 7 Isaiah fifty four fourteen, In righteousness shalt thou be established, thou shalt be far from oppression, for thou shalt not fear and from terror, for it shall not come near thee. Isaiah fifty four fourteen. Psalm seventeen six to nine I have called upon thee, for thou wilt hear me, O God, incline thine ear unto me and hear my speech. Show thy marvellous loving kindness, O thou that savest by thy right hand them which put their trust in thee from those that rise up against them. Them. Keep me as the apple of the eye. Hide me under the shadow of thy wings. From the wicked that oppress me, from my deadly enemies who compass me about. Psalm seventeen, six to nine. Second Peter two, nine. The Lord knoweth how to deliver the godly out of temptations, and to reserve the unjust unto the day of judgment to be punished. Second Peter 2, 9 Psalm 121 
I will lift up mine eyes unto the hills, from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord, which made heaven and earth. He will not suffer thy foot to be moved. He that keepeth thee will not slumber. Behold, he that keepeth Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord is thy keeper, the Lord is thy shade upon thy right hand. The sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve thee from all evil, he shall preserve thy soul. The Lord shall preserve thy going out, and thy coming in from this time forth and even for evermore Psalm 121 Psalm 91 He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in Him will I trust. Surely He shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noise and pestilence. He shall cover thee with his feathers, and under his wings shalt thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flieth by day, nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness, nor for the destruction that wasteth at noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but it shall not come nigh thee. Only with thine eyes shalt thou behold and see the reward of the wicked, because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the Most High, the habitation. There shall no evil Befall thee, neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling, for he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee and all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against a stone. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and natter, the young lion and the dragon shalt thou trample under feet because he hath set his love upon me therefore will i deliver him i will set him on high because he hath known my name he shall call upon me and i will answer him i will be with him in trouble i will deliver him and honor him with long life will i satisfy him and show him my salvation psalm 91